Hello you lot, um, this is a super, super quick video. This is not like, this is not, not the video I wanted to make. This isn't that video. This is just uh, me uh, having a chat with you guys. And I, I didn't even think about thinking about making a video just to explain to you why I'm moving to Twitch. But I just wanted to have a quick chat with you because <laughs> the stream with Paul, the last stream, and the whole series of the Football Manager stream series has just been really, really like special and lovely. And I didn't expect it to be like that at all. I thought it was just going to be a nice place where I could kind of basically give me an excuse to sort of get my fill of, of waiting for a ball to cross a line and me being able to go crazy about it, which obviously we're all missing a lot. Yes! Get in there! Come on the Rs! Yes! We have to give, give them the gift of life! And it's just an excuse for me to sit with my mates. And so I thought it was a really good, ex easy excuse to sit down with them and have a bit of fun and see if we could get QPR to the Premier League. Come on, the lads! Oh, no! no. Come on, the lads! Listen to me. 4-4-2. Four, four, Come on, boys! <laughs> Come on, the lads. You know the sidebar. You know the emails. You love it. But that last stream <laughs> was ridiculous, wasn't it? I, I, I literally... I couldn't understand what was going on. It was so funny. Oh, that's so annoying. Oh, well. Did they so get we've... They... Whoa! What all? What all? What all? What all? What all? Yes! <laughs> oh! <laughs> yes! Get in there! Celebrate with the fans! 90 plus 5 oh, minutes! Yeah, no! <laughs> get in there, lads! Yes! <laughs> Can you believe it? This is ours! No! No! <laughs> No! Oh my oh god. Oh my god. So many people were messaging me going, I'm gutted mate, I just can't believe it. Um, I really thought we had it. Which means you're invested in it, like I'm invested in it, as you saw. Uh, as Paul got sort of sucked into it, Lawrence obviously loved it and has been amazing as an assistant manager as well. And all the other guys as well getting involved and just having a bit of fun with it all. So that's why I'm making a video now, just to say to you and explain what I'm thinking of doing with the series. Those of you who subscribed from the start, you'll know that I've always liked to try different ideas and different types of content. And I sort of promised myself at the start of creating a YouTube channel for myself, that I would just do that. If I wanted to try something, I would do it. The thing with the streams is that I feel like, I'm not sure it's totally totally compatible with YouTube and a YouTube channel and the YouTube algorithm. I think there's a better way that I can package those streams for you guys to enjoy in 25 minutes instead of three hours. And Twitch is so casual and fun and it's a place where I reckon I'm going to be able to just go, I feel like playing FIFA with my mate Flav for a bit. So we're going to go on Twitch and do it. If you want to come and sit with us and chat with us, come over and do it. That's what I see Twitch as for me. I see it as three things. One, the full Football Manager series when I want to go and do it. And I think I'm going to look to try and do it at the same time. So that will be on there. Playing FIFA with my mate Craig or Dom or Flav or whoever I want to play with. Um, playing FIFA on there as well. It's almost just like a room that I can stream from have that same connection with you guys, which has always been really important, but it's something that fits and works on Twitch. I also want to make really good content that you can enjoy on YouTube. So what I'm going to try and do is take those streams, obviously they'll be recorded, and then put them into wiki packages. So if you're not into Twitch, that's fine, but it is really easy. You just search or click on my profile and I'll be there. And, you know, if you follow me on Twitter, you'll know when I'm streaming. I'll try and be as consistent as possible. But then you'll have an amazing, wicked, condensed, series of the exact same stream. So if you miss those streams, it's not the end of the world, you can watch those. And then also that allows me to keep doing the process or trying other silly ideas and allow that YouTube channel to still be a YouTube channel where I can try a lot of different things. I think some of my other types of content have struggled at times because I'm doing a lot of different kind of lengths of content and you know, you're doing a lot of live stuff, which does well, and then other stuff's not doing well. I feel like it's getting a touch messy. So I'm just trying to kind of make content and put content on different platforms that are compatible to the content that we're making. That's the idea. Is the Football Manager series going to carry on? Yes, it ain't over. 
it ain't over we get into the Premier League. Playing on FIFA, I've got a lot of growth to do when it comes to FIFA. Chilling out with my mates on there as well. There's a much longer list of people that haven't been able to get on the streams just yet. When all this calms down again and we can enjoy football again, where we can go there and have a chat and you can be a part of that. It can be two hours long, it can be three hours long, it can be at seven in the morning, it can be at seven at night, it doesn't really matter. The best bits, we'll put them on the YouTube channel but they will be videos that work on YouTube. I've never been afraid of trying those different things and it's something that I want to kind of enjoy and explore at the moment. So that's what, that's what we're gonna do, lads and ladies. So if you wanna come on over there, that's great. If you don't, that's cool. There is a new episode of The Process with Johnny Nelson, who's the presenter for Ringside, but he is a, he's a world champion boxer and he's got the most amazing story and he says some amazing stuff. He, he spoke about offering to coach Joe Weller, talk about his mindset and the journey that he went through to become a world champion because he failed f two times before he, he got there. Spoiler alert. Just want to say thank you to anyone who was in any of the streams who got behind it and got behind QPR. Uh, it's not over. Come and join me on Twitch if you want to be there live with me. We'll be going again next week. It's going to be amazing. It has been amazing. Massive thank you. I can't believe Wallace gave away that penalty. What was he thinking? Jack Reeve from Talk Norwich City said, why isn't he not just showing him wide? I, can't, I could not agree more. We gave it everything and we will go again.